Somebody call the law. Somebody call the law. It got to be illegal for me to be so wrong. What up, though? Heist man, the foe talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions. Man, we is back at it once again. Pop the balloon of five love episode 13, man. We finna do this, man. We finna get into it, man. You know how we do over here, man. We judge bitches. Or, you know, we just talk about people. Y'all know what I'm talking about, man. Here we go. Let's get into it. <laughs> Get on the paint. Tattoo on her leg. You see her. She got the greasy face. Okay. Little pigeon toe. Painty. I see. Look at that. Tamar Braxton. 40 bars. Look at that. The sundress season. Welcome back to my channel. It's your host Arlette, and we are back with another episode man. of Pop the Balloon or Find Love. And today we've got some beautiful single ladies lined up. Make some noise, ladies! Right. Oh, okay. <laughs> All Look, right. So we're gonna go ahead and be bringing out some single men. They're gonna come out one by one. And when he comes around, you know, if he's your type, you know, the height, you know, beard, facial hair, whatever it is, you're feeling him, do not pop your balloon. Oh, but if there's man. anything that's just like, oh, no, this is not my guy, go ahead and pop it. And I'll go over to each of you, see why you ended up popping. Y'all ready? Okay, let's get some matches. So let's go ahead and bring out our first single guy. Uh-oh, see this nigga. Hello, welcome in. I'll have you hold that. Uh, What's your name? My name is Alistair. Alistair. Alistair, how old are you? I'm 36 years old. 36, okay. And what do you do? I'm a deputy sheriff. All oh, right, Lord. okay. And what Bye. are some things you like Look. to do for fun? I like to travel. These bitches want to smoke reefer. I reefer. like to go on trips. Okay. <laughs> and what are some things you look for in a woman? Um, someone that's intelligent, very laid back, knows what she wants. Mm -hmm. And they like YG in the face. Okay. And now what are some of your deal breakers? My deal breakers will be smokers. Mm. That's the number one thing, okay. smokers. Got yeah, it. Okay. Quit. So we did get a couple of pop balloons. Let's go on over to these ladies and see why they ended up popping. Yes. Okay. All right. Let's start over here. If we can have your smoke. name and age. Today. Alexis, and I'm 29. Yeah. And Alexis, what do you do? Bud. I'm a realtor. Nice. Now, uh, why did you end up popping your balloon? She had a nightgown on? Um, he just didn't really seem like too much my type, mm -hmm. and um, I don't know about the police, oh, honestly. Look, I told you I'm not <laughs> the police. But you're an attractive man, so, you know, no thank hard you, Thank you, thank you, thank <laughs> you. All right, and now, I mean, like OT is Genesis. Alexis someone that's your type? Of course, you very attractive, very beautiful. Head. It is someone that I will approach. Okay, thank right. you. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, let's go into our next pop balloon over here. Okay, if we can have your name and age. My name is Tiffany, and I'm 26 years old. Thank you, and Tiffany, what do you do? I am an exotic dancer, but I use my money from exotic dancing to fund my business ventures. Ooh, okay, mm -hmm. all right. And now, uh, why did you end up popping your balloon? Well, first of all, he said that he don't, you know, like smokers. I'm a big smoker. He said it's and sick. I don't think... You know, the police and an exotic dancer would mix. <laughs> but other than that, I like the way you're built. You know, I like the age. I'm, I'm into older men, so. Okay. Got it. Thank you. Thank you. And now, Alistair, is uh, Tiffany someone that's your type? Of course. Very beautiful. Very attractive. Yeah, so definitely someone I'll approach. Okay. Got it. So she's an exotic she's dancer. Please don't mix. Is, is, that, <laughs> <laughs> is that something that would stop you from approaching her if you knew that? No. Okay. No. Oh, really? fine. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Let's go on over here. Okay. If we can have your name and age. Yes. Hi. I'm C and I'm 36. 
And C, what do you do? I'm in medical sales. Right. Okay. And so why did you end why up popping you your like balloon? A keeper? Um, well, I just have to give it to you. You were the first guy to come out, and I know that we can only pick one guy, so I'm just waiting. She's like, you ain't it. Okay. But you is he someone that is your type? Um, Not maybe if I got to know him a little bit better, but... That bitch dressed you know, like a trapper keeper. I'm right now, I'm just you. waiting. Okay. All right. Yeah, so, I mean, uh, Alistair, day, is she strange. someone that is your type? Oh. Very respectable individual. Looks like you can have a great conversation, and I like that. Thank you. Thank you. Let's go on to our next lady. If we can have your name and age. My name is Nkiru and I'm 32 years old. Okay. And what do you do? I work with a pharmaceutical company as a monitor. Okay, very nice. And now why did you end up she popping your like balloon? Put, put golf. Um, she I don't like know, he's just table. not my type. Like, just, I don't know. If I'm basing off of looks, he's just not my type. Okay. Okay. And so what about him is not really nice your type? Skin. That haircut um, nasty. It's I ugly. don't really know. I just, I just don't feel the connection. I don't like that little okay. bob yes. thing she okay. got going on. And now, same thing, Alistair. Is she someone that you would approach? Uh, she's very respectable, very beautiful. I believe all the women here are beautiful. Mm. Okay. All right. The key to great skin ah, is exfoliating on, and moisturizing. Old Spice gives me both. Switch to Chrome to load your favorite sites fast, so you can browse with ease. Fast, on, safe, yours. Come on. Thank you. Let's go on to our next lady over here. If we can have your name and age. My name is Danielle, and I'm 35. My name's Daniel. Danielle, what do you do? I work at Human Resources. Damn, Daniel. And why did you end up popping your balloon? Um, honestly, it's because he's the police. Oh. It's a handsome man. I mean, handsome woman. <laughs> okay, so apart from him being a police officer, he is someone that is your type? She thick, too. Yeah, I mean, I don't necessarily go off of like, uh, looks, per se, so... If we had a conversation, maybe. Okay, but all right. He'd probably say, <laughs> <She's like>, man. <laughs> okay, Alistair, I know you said everyone's beautiful, but is she someone that's your type? If you saw her out, you'd approach her? Uh, yes, I will approach yeah, her. Yeah, I hope we'll And how we see this police thing is taking you <laughs> out. Like, is that ever a problem when it comes to dating? Uh, I know law enforcement is a very, you know, skeptical career to be yeah, in. Yeah, punk ass cop, yeah, too. I respect I everyone. By him. I joined this career because it's be what's calling for me, yeah. and I like what I do. Okay, good. I'm a protector. So if you need someone to protect you, I'm someone to protect you. Period. <laughs> All right, let's go back ah. this way. We did get a pop. If we can have your name Ora and Blanco. age. Caprice, Ora 32. Blanco. Okay, Blanco. and Caprice, what do you do? I am a certified Christian Ora life coach. Blanco. Okay, and now why did you end up popping your balloon? Um, Just initially, it just wasn't enough bass in your voice. Yeah, bitch um, ass nigga. Sorry. Okay. That hat okay. ugly too. You came Alistair, in there with goddamn. I feel like I know what hat. you're about to say. Thank you, school <laughs> boy Q. Oh, oh. You approach her if you see her Sour out. Green. Um, I'm respectable to everyone. I give everyone a chance to get to know you, sit down, have a conversation, let you know my goals in life, and I see your goals in life. And if we do match, take it further from there. Did I get everyone back here? Oh, oh, oh. Okay, we do have one more pop balloon back here. If we can have so your name and age. My name is Lexi, and I'm 27. Lexi, what do you do? I am a full-time biomedical science student stupid. and a birth doula. You a doula? Okay, and now why did you end up popping your balloon? You Erica, uh, well, um, do, bitch. unlike everybody else, like the police thing didn't really bother me, mm. but like as I like kind of walked, it was like kind of like the haircut in the back is like not fully cut, mm. and then <laughs> the chap lips. Nigga uh, lips chap. It's kind of a okay. thing for me. So <laughs> got me looking yeah, mine. Got okay. my mm -hmm. Alistair. <laughs> <laughs> We all already know I'm your a, lines by now. <laughs> I'm respectable to criticism. That's that's you know, that's who I am as a person. You know when them Africans you know, they brought on the damn show. You know, I'm from the Caribbean, so we're used oh, to see? criticism Caribbean. and but you know, you're a beautiful individual and I'm thankful for having me out here and you all are very beautiful. Thank you. I'm very respectful some of them, person. Some of them. They think, and then oh, we did get one I'm last one down him. here. What is this? Oh, this is my hat. All right, if we can have your name and age. Kiana thirty two. And Kiana, what do you do? Um, well, I'm in the health health field, mm -hmm. CNA, also in real estate, and I'm the supervisor at a a shoe store. So okay. yeah, very, very busy. <laughs> and now, why did you end up popping your balloon? She look made up. Um, she got on. She I just felt like sticking to the code. You know, I didn't have no problem with the law enforcement and whatnot. But when that outfit yeah, come out, feel like I should be sticking to the code. Right no more. Okay. What do you mean by sticking to the she code? Nice just, that's honestly like you know, I just felt like everybody kind of reminded me and whatnot. So yeah, 
that's just life. So. <laughs> Sorry, I'm I'm a little confused. It reminded you of what? <laughs> no, um, because you know I'm just mentioning about him episode. being in law enforcement, kind of and um, so I just felt although I don't see it as a problem, grown, there's man. always been a history behind it. Mm. So I just would just follow that. I don't follow too many, but I'll follow that. So yeah. Okay. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Cool. <laughs> so Alistair. Is she someone that you would approach if you saw her out? Yeah, I'm very respectable for every oh. individual that I meet. <laughs> I'm very respectable. Got it. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Get out of here, you, man. Right. Nobody Let's want that damn back. shirt. So, like, turn the TV off. Unfortunately, like, that some. is all of the balloons popped, but we do thank you so much for coming on. Let's give it up thank for him, you, ladies. That's what the shirt look like. The snow time. Get, get out of here, nigga. Everybody pop their balloon on you, nigga. At Harbor Freight, we're committed to ensuring our tools are expertly engineered and built to last. Built to last. Harbor Freight. Go shop good. All right. Let's go ahead and bring out our next single guy. This is like a plant in this green. This shit look nasty. Hello. Welcome in. What's your name? I'm Will. Sorry? Will. Oh, Will. Will. Okay, Will, how old are you? I'm 31. I just turned 31 about three weeks ago. Okay, all right. And what do you do, Will? Soft. I am a civil litigation paralegal in the last semester of law school. Okay, congrats. Almost done. Thank you, Tom. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And now, what are some things you look for in a woman? Uh, I look for someone that is revealing. I don't like it's someone it, too shy or uh, reserved. This is a little bit tough to get to know. Okay. I also like a, uh, a progressive woman and uh, someone kind. Not Okay. And now what are some of your deal breakers? Uh, someone unkind. <laughs> someone. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh, I'm a pretty, uh, I have standards, but I don't have a, uh, I'm a pretty chill guy. Got it. I like you a, a normal, normal person. Okay. All YouTube right, cool. Bench, huh? So we did get a couple of pop balloons. Let's go on over yeah. to those ladies and see yes, what's going on. Yeah. All right. If we can have your name and age. Alexis, I'm 29. Okay. And Alexis, why did you end up popping your balloon? Um, I just feel like the physical attraction wasn't too much there. Like, I think we almost the same height. Mm. How tall are you? I'm 5'8". Oh, damn. Okay. Well, I guess these heels <laughs> are doing something. Short mother. <laughs> a little too short for my liking, but okay. Okay. you look good. Well, so thank you, thank you. Thank you. And how tell me you look good, but you don't want to date because it's height. <laughs> Yeah, so bitch, I'm I mean, ten foot tall. I stand in my wallet, bitch. Level, kind of. Mm. Okay. <laughs> now, Will is uh, is she someone that is your type? Uh, yes, ma'am. She she's very beautiful. Uh, yeah, definitely. Okay. I throw that word okay. beautiful around. Let's go on to our next lady over here. If she we can have your name. Beautiful at all. I'm Lexi, and I'm 27. Okay, and Lexi, why did you end up popping your balloon? Um, I popped it because he said that he wanted someone that was easy to get to know. And I am a little bit hard to get to know. Um, aside from that, like, he's really handsome. And, like, the height didn't really bother me either. But I am a little bit hard to get you to like know. You like Goro. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so I don't mean, uh, well, That's all you need is two more arms. So I, I don't mean, uh, ribs, anyone that is, uh, street fighter. I guess available to anybody. Of course, you have to be selective. But as far as dating, you do want to get to know somebody. And dating is already... A bit of a task in itself so to add those unnecessary um boundaries it's a, it's a bit difficult to deal with understandable understandable okay. cool man <laughs> and now is she someone that is your type yes ma'am definitely i like tall women too so. oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay all right let's go on over to our next yeah. balloon <laughs> if we can have your name and age caprice 32. okay and caprice why did you end up you popping like your balloon caprice son. Um, <laughs> He you said he liked tall women. I'm clearly fun sized. Oh my God. I'm... You know he didn't mean it like <laughs> that. <laughs> it is what it is. I mean. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's, you ain't missing <laughs> So, much. apart from him saying that, is he someone that is your type, though? Uh, yes, he's attractive, nice teeth, very beautiful smile, love the color skin. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. You look like schoolboy right. Q. Now she's someone that is your type? Man, 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 she, man. She, she, she pretty fly. I like that. Okay. Right, cool. I like the tattoo. <laughs> Thanks. Mm, okay. So, I mean, you did say he is your type. You kind of misheard him a little bit when he said, he said he doesn't mind tall women. He don't discriminate against height. Okay, I'll give him another try. Oh, you better because okay, let's gonna get pick that pick balloon back. <laughs> <coughs> okay, we'll you be back for you. you. <laughs> let's go to our next lady. If we can have your name and age. I'm C and I'm 36. Okay, and C, why did you pop your balloon? 
I would just prefer a guy. I, I hear Velcro every time she pop on screen. Okay. I hear Velcro. All right. I see a trap. Can I see keeper. someone that you type? Yes, ma'am. Very, very beautiful skin. She pretty fly. Oh. Yeah, I like. She she got some style. She to too meek. Like she Thank just you. holding her hands down <laughs> to her side. Right. Like Let's that. go to our next lady over oh, here. Oh no, them shoes. We have your name and age. My name is Inkira and I'm 32. Okay. And Inkira, why did you end up popping your balloon? Uh, same thing as well for her. Like same thing she said. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry. Just the height difference. Mm, yes. Got it, got it. Now she's someone that you would approach if you saw her. Maybe like a bottle of perfume. Okay. All right. And so, what makes her kind of your type? Uh, like I said, I don't, I don't mind uh, this bitch got a anything shot like nose that. She's very beautiful. She looks well put together as well. Mm -hmm. So. Thank you. Definitely. <laughs> All right. Oh, thank this. you. If we can have your name and age. I'm Danielle, and I'm 35. I'm Daniel. And Danielle, why did you pop your balloon? I don't particularly want a short king either, <laughs> but I do think he's very handsome. Okay. Everything about him is really spot on. Just I just, I, I hate when bitches say I'm that shit. Seven, so we about the same height. I hate when bitches say that. They say this nigga everything they looking for, but he right there, but they don't want him. Oh, he's nice. He look, he look great. He look... Bitches. <laughs> <laughs> so, but. Okay, got it. No. I feel like I know what you're about to say, but I'm gonna still ask anyway. Is she someone that's your type? Yes, ma'am. I'd okay. approach her. Okay. You approach her? What makes her your type? Uh, she pretty, pretty nice build. She got a nice smile. She seems personable as well. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Let's go to our next lady over here. Yeah, you approach her. Cottage yeah. Business is here to set you up with tech solutions that adapt to your business needs, like reliable. If we can have your name and age. Kiana, 32. Okay. And Kiana, why did you end up popping your balloon? She got in her face. Well, I mean, I Look seen him rings. from afar, so I was thinking maybe he's not too short. Dang, this is like 06. Uh, too short, I mean, and, like and, but then, you know, I'm 5'9", and with heels, I'm like 6'1", so yeah. My apologies. She's a high maintenance probably broke. How many kids Okay, you now, Will, is she someone that is your type? Yes, ma'am, and I, I wouldn't mind the height, but even with heels <laughs> on, so. I know, but, but yeah. Oh no, no, I don't. I don't want to convince you to change answer, but. <laughs> oh no. no, no. Yeah. Well, thank you though. She tried to get chose. Thank you. All right. Let's she tried to get chose. This way, so we still do have two unpopped balloons. I'm gonna right. go ahead and have you ask these ladies a question, just to kind of help you see which one is more of your match. Okay. You better uh, take the damn. Ooh. So, what do you ladies look for in a man? Mm. Okay. Let's start with your Ooh, name and geez. age, and what do you look for in a man? My name is Tiffany and I'm 26. And what I look for in a man is like a leader, a guider, someone who can give me knowledge and take mm. from what I give them too. Also someone who wants to build pretty much, yeah. I like that, I like that, okay. I like that. All right. <laughs> we got your name and age earlier. So what are some things you look for in a man? What I look for in a man is a man of integrity, a man of character, a man that know how to cultivate the woman God called me to be, a Shut man up. that know how to have a kind and gentle spirit. You know how to have I'm fun. I'm trying to use God and just that's good. I like YouTube the one with a little edge to it too. So that's, okay, that's okay, <laughs> ladies. Any questions for him? Okay. So, what's most important to you, physical attraction or mental stimulation? Uh, mental stimulation. If I could, if I could uh, be a bit uh, honest, hopefully it don't sound too lewd. But uh, I think when in the future, when I'm no longer uh, say as active. As I am, I look for someone that I could talk about anything with and every nothing brown, with. Brown, red. Okay. Good. Mm -hmm. Okay. Light skin with the baby hairs. Do you mind a woman with kids? No, I don't. No, I guess I should have said that. You know she I got kids. Year old, so. Okay, if, and if the, this follow-up question: You only have one? Yeah. Okay, good. We don't need more than one baby mama. <laughs> <laughs> so, do you have kids? Yes, I have a two-year-old. Oh, is it too? Congratulations. Oh, to be. <laughs> In the blue, so you can see the All right. Of Any further questions before I have you pop one of them? Uh, oh, she look crazy. So I, I, I do you better go for one unless you can cook and hold a family so, down. Yeah, <laughs> yeah go with orange. Go with okay. Orange. So long distance, I'm guessing, is a no. It's only because I really like I'm I'm a, I'm a clingy person. <laughs> like I'm very I'm a Gemini. I want to be loved. Like all, I want all the attention. Okay. So it's kind of hard to do that when you're far away. Far away. Mm, okay. You had to go for orange. Is that gonna be a problem for you? It doesn't bother me. Oh. She's like a homemaker. Mm -hmm. She okay. Hey, she a good girl. You wanna stay? You, hmm? you wanna stay? It depends if you give me a reason to leave. 
Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> Let me just bring you on up here. Come on yeah, up. Yeah, come on and it's by your speed right there, bro. You good. All she, right, she so winner. any final questions between the, either one of you before? You know she got that thing on. So in, in this season of your life, what makes you believe that you're ready for love? Oh, no. Uh, because I have made myself available to she it and my heart right is eye. open for it. I've done a, a, a lot Man, of things like. in my life, a uh, 10 year army vet as well. So I've been a, a lot, a lot of places. And, and I believe that I've accomplished profile. most of the things I want to accomplish on my own. Okay. Like that answer. Y'all kids going to look just okay. exactly like that. So y'all. is it going to be a yes for you for him? Yes. Ah, is it a yes for you for her? Yes, ma'am. We got a yeah, all right, let's won. go ahead and bring out our he next single guy. She's probably like the cleanest and purest. Hello, welcome in. I'll have you hold this. This nigga. <laughs> What's your name? My name is Sydney. Sorry, hold Sydney. the mic up. Sydney? Yes. Okay, Sydney, how old what are you? That, what I'm is that shark bag? 35, and what do you do? Why is it so um, I own a luxury car rental service. Okay. Um, and I also manage celebrity talent. Very oh cool. What is this uh, What are some oh things you look for in a woman? Uh, this nigga. I love someone that's in touch with Why the emotional intelligence. you bring the bag with you? Intelligence. Someone who could connect on that side mm. um, and who has, you know, a level of self-esteem. You like a liar. You like a liar. Got it, got it. And now, what are some of your deal breakers? Deal breakers is a lack of confidence. So somebody mm. who may have daddy issues that's unresolved. Okay. Um, so those are my deal breakers, but I'm pretty open. Issues. I love to just connect first and kind of see where that go. Got it, okay. Now what are some things you like to do for fun? So I'm, I'm big on traveling. Mm. Um, I love shopping. Okay. Um, and I, I love to kind of really try different type of foods. Got it. So yeah. Okay, yeah, I see you big on shopping. You came out with the bag, everything. Yeah, I'm, I'm in my bag, and I'm full of surprises. I just want to make sure you know that. Look, look, bitch, look. That's some corny okay, ass so shit. so we did get a few pop balloons. Cool. Let's see, go I got to do this shit with, with my wife, man, so she can judge these I'll leave this here. Man. Okay. <laughs> if we can have I your mean, name. I she chose me, so. My name is man. Lexi, and I'm 27. Hey, Lexi, this I'm nigga, man. Hi. Lexi, why'd you end up popping your balloon? I popped my balloon just because of the eyebrows. Like, you have your eyebrows done, and I don't really even do my own eyebrows, so it's just kind of like... Eh, I don't want you in the mirror longer than I'm in the mirror. Yeah, thick ass so, eyebrows, yeah. man. Got it. <laughs> so now is Lexi someone that's your type? Lexi's very beautiful. Thank you. You just approached very me back cool. in the day. So she, she saw her out, you'd approach her? I, I would. Okay, yes. come, come. All right, let's go to our next pop balloon. All right, if we can have your name and age. Hi, I'm C and I'm 36. I'm trapping keep up. And C, why did you end up popping your balloon? I prefer men that aren't too flashy. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And he, he kinda, what about he him giving off flashy? All that, the bag, all that bullshit the, you got on just, the bag. Yeah, I prefer. Got a shoulder belt. Less the for men. Taco meat yeah. with the chain and all that's that. Fair. More low key. Yeah, that's fair. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Have you gotten that before? Um, not necessarily, because I'm I'm a person that kind of really switch up my styles. I kind of wear that nigga weak. Yeah, I'm man. a man of many hats, so I wear a lot of different looks. You, you, so he today was one of those things I just kind of figured out. On, man. I want to take you after this. Gotcha. That nigga got dick one. All right, now I see someone that you approach if you saw her. Very beautiful again. I'm gonna show up in white teeth. What's up? What we doing? We did get one back here. Let's go back. Regular. All right, if we can have your name and age. This nigga corny. Alexis, and I'm 29. All right, and Alexis, why did you end up popping your balloon? I mean, he's so we need to see these bitches like faces. too pretty. Mm. Like, you could tell you do a lot getting ready and stuff. Like how she said, she doesn't want a man in the mirror longer than she is. Hey, but man. I mean, hey, you, you look good. Ain't nothing wrong keeping yourself really looking nice. Type. Fuck that. Okay. 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 <laughs> that same thing. Is she someone that you would approach? <laughs> She seemed like she has a great personality, very pleasant. How many toes that bitch got? Look at her feet. Homemade dimples. I like the little dimples sitting there. Yeah. And then again, you know, I love red carpets. I like going to the gala. I love really, just really nice places to go. So I didn't, wasn't sure about the area out here. So I wanted to kind of make sure I was dressed for the occasion. But I appreciate that. You look hot, nigga. You look stupid. You could always get your balloons back, lady. Oh. Hey, it's not only how you're dressed. It's it's in your face. It's in my face, too. You're you're a pretty boy. Okay. It's not Pretty bad. ugly. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Pretty ugly, though. Thank you. Like Let's the, go um, down over the here. The running back used to play for um the Cowboys. All right. If Z we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. You like this my name is Nkiru, and I'm 32. Dude, 32. Uh, the reason why I pop, uh, I think I see, like, tattoos. Okay. Yeah, I really don't do tattoos. Oh, you I'm got some sorry. tattoos. Yes. Okay. Yes. Where are you from, by the way? 
I'm Nigerian. Nigerian. Yeah. Nigerian. Yeah. A lot of friends from Nigeria. Yeah. Very, yeah. I'm Beautiful from culture. Nigeria. Thank you. Yes. And actually, my, my last like girlfriend was from Africa. Mm. So, yeah. Nice. Very interesting. I love the culture, Nigerian. by the way. Nice. Thank but you. Thank you. Thanks. Yep. All right. And now she's someone that you type? Beautiful. Yes, again. Thank yes. you. Yes, she's caught, she's, she connects with our culture and her Wait background. Me. That's a beautiful thing. Thank you. Yeah. Let's go to our next, oh, actually, no, there ain't no next lady. I lied. Let's go back. Let's go back. <laughs> All right, so we do have three unpopped balloons. I'm going to go ahead and have you ask the ladies a question. You're going to go for the big face light skin, girl. What, what more can't we say? Morning, crazy, babe. Though. I made you breakfast. <laughs> Hey, um, wait, what do you guys like to do? And thank you for keeping your what balloons. You Could you like tell me a little bit about do yourself? Do you? Look, that nigga okay. mink and Let's start right man. here with your name. He a, he a scam My artist, name is yeah. Tiffany, and I'm 26 years old. Um, I like traveling as well. I love trying new foods. I love doing new things. Um, I'm still, like, in my 20s, yeah. so I like to just try You're everything new. Looking. Like, I'm a very adventurous that person. creepy, dog. Spontaneous. Yes, I'm creepy. Very spontaneous. I love that. I love that. Any particular type of food? That nigga you showed like? him with my um, sister. I love like, Italian food. That's your man? Mm -hmm. I love that. Why so do nigga like that, yo? He weird. So do I. Weird. Thank you. He's like a fucking <laughs> Let's go to our next lady. evangelist or something, yo. We'll start with your name and fake. age you and then the answer this question. Weird. I'm Danielle and I'm 35. Mm -hmm. Oh. So and then the answer to this question. Things that I like to do? Yeah. Oh, okay. So I feel like I'm pretty adventurous and spontaneous. Um. I'm kind of down for whatever. I do like to have fun. I like to go out and dance. Um, I like to lounge. I like to also be at home. You like to be at home? I like that. I like that. Car what about your favorite food? Any, any particular food you like? I love to eat. I have a yeah, very restricted diet. Okay. Very restricted. Um, okay. I was a vegetarian hormones. for six years, mm -hmm. and I only eat chicken and turkey. Oh, wow. Um, but I don't eat any dairy products. I don't take in any cow's milk, anything like that. Okay. That's very interesting. As long as you look at her, she, <laughs> do you live in the area? She's a bad-looking bitch. Okay. She just yep. look kind of nice to meet aggressive. You. All right. Face. Let's go on to our next lady. We'll start with your name and she age, and then just to answer to his question. She look better than her. Look uh, at her. My name's Kiana. Like she I'm had so much 32. Um... You said name, age, and, She'll and pick then me. Look your question her. was? Just a little bit about what you like to do, what you enjoy doing. Oh, um, she them black girls I love to travel. Mm -hmm. um, I like to work. I'm very busy, so nice. that's also something that I do enjoy. Mm -hmm. um, I'd be like, ugh, bitch. Shopping. Uh, what do you want? Yeah, that's what I asked. What the yeah. fuck you want? Nice. I love very shopping. Basic, like, like, yeah. I love shopping. Oh, what do you like shit. to shop? What do you enjoy it? shopping? Um, everywhere. Just like, a little bit of everything. Yeah, like I like my Forever 21s, H&Ms, but mm -hmm. then I also like my Ferragamo, Gucci, and stuff nice. like that. So uh, There's nothing wrong with that. So you work hard, play hard? Yeah. I like that. <laughs> yeah. I look at him so I have like... eight sisters, so I kind of connect on different levels right. with different people, and they kind of all taught me kind of really how to all just... Right. I wouldn't approach her. Yeah, I think I'm have their own different tastes. Yeah. You know, so eight sisters, her. eight different personalities. So <laughs> I, I like, like that. Ah, Very okay. beautiful, though. What the fuck you want? Yeah, yes. Right. Talking to me. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, so kind of based off of those responses you heard, I'm going to have you pop one of those ladies' balloon. If I can just borrow your pick. I'm going to get this over to you. That's easy money right there. I know, there. it's and tough. Red. They are all gorgeous ladies. <laughs> can I ask, like, one more question? Next round. For this round, you That's do have to pop that red. one. Uh -huh. <laughs> she'll go and she'll try to use that nigga. <sighs> Find out the dick whack and cheat on him. She'll strip it to him. Oh. I don't know. That's a tough one. <laughs> I bet. <laughs> oh. Uh, I'll just go with her. Okay. I saw it was really, really tough. It was tough. Yeah. That was tough. So why did we end up going with oh. hers? It was tough. I love the fact that you, you took a chance, even with your age. Mm -hmm. And I love the fact that you're very spontaneous and that you're open to new things. She's going to take all and your money, dog. And that you okay dog. with a, a guy that kind of take care of himself. I wish he would have gone. My barber went a little too far. <laughs> he did that. But um, See, but that's that cool. Nigga, Something that nigga I learned ball, from or whatever. I wish but, um, you would have got I think you're very beautiful. Nigga. Thank you. And um, I'm sure you're going to find somebody that connects very well Thanks. with you. So, <laughs> she yeah. about that shit. She would have fucked that nigga. Over. No, um, honestly, like, I, I don't mind flashy. I'm very, like, over the top myself. So mm -hmm. I didn't mind that. Um, She's I like that when nigga. someone takes me to do new things or try yeah. to do new things. I love a man that loves women. So knowing that you have a bunch of sisters, I have a bunch of sisters yeah. as well. That was a really, like, 
good yeah, things for me. Thing. So. You know, I really, I'm I just, chic, and my sister, I've learned a lot from them, 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 you know, but taking care of yourself, know you, bitch. you, you know, and just really just, just being you got I think a woman want a man who's clean. I like a man that goes to nail salon with me too. Right. don't necessarily go to the nail salon. Like, I used to own a chain of barbershops, so. You know, I, I always think that it's important to make sure that you maintain your look, especially if you want someone who, zesty, dog. you know, who wants to connect with you and you represent them. So I think that I represent just like I represent a few talents in the industry. I represent my woman. What was your deal me. breaker for me? Well, the huh? deal breaker for me was really just your age. It was the age. <laughs> <My older> men. <laughs> you know, my last girlfriend was close to your age. Oh. Um, and sometimes in the area of that, there's a little bit of just uncertainty. Oh, so you're up. Um, just uncertainty. Yeah. You're learning a lot, and um, you need somebody you know, on the same level. There's some room for growth for all of us. Mm -hmm. So I was just look. I was just looking at that. Like but you're you're very beautiful, and I could tell we could really get along. You have really good energy. Thank you. You have really good energy, <laughs> okay. like red carpet stuff. Just getting out there and just having fun and connecting. I mean, you talking too I much. Really didn't you got two what they over there to but that's okay. You can ask our next two ladies. Come on, come right, on, right. come on. <laughs> She's trying to spin. Try the block. Cascade Platinum Plus. She it removes to up to one hundred percent of food residue, even in. Come on, man. We don't need to hear this bullshit. Weeks. To build the website you need with full. Art. <laughs> All right. So, what do you do? I work in human resources. Human okay. resources. Excellent. So, so you basically you work in human resources, just keeping everything organized uh, and making sure everyone's following the company policies and things like that. Pretty much. Yeah, that's the older version. <laughs> Any of other you. side things you enjoy doing, or you do like side work or jobs, hustles, or businesses? Um, not currently. I'm okay. kind of focused on my career and uh, growing where I am currently. Nice. Um, so that's, that's interesting. Nice. Bottom nice, thing, nice, bitch. nice. I see that too. Right. Down okay. There. All right. And what do you do? Um, well, I am a CNA, mm -hmm. and also I um, am a supervisor at a, a shoe store in real estate. Real estate. So, Excellent. Yeah. Okay. I do real, real estate, estate as well. Oh, that's I nice. really do. Um, do you live in an area? No, Miami. Oh, you live in Miami? I live in okay. Miami. Look, boom. All right. That's pretty, that's nice. That's yeah. nice. Just here you go. Okay. All right. Um, any children? I have a daughter. I have a daughter. Um, she's 12 years old. All right. But I uh, I do want five kids total. Oh, wow. So, yeah. You want to use a nigga, man. She's just my first one. Okay. So I have a lot of work to do. I hear you. <laughs> do you have any kids? I do have a daughter. Okay. Yes. I do have a daughter. I think it's important, you know, understanding that a woman that has a daughter, to me, she, she made room in her life to add someone else. Because that's not easy. So this being independent and by yourself, sometimes Where sometimes women become selfish and just kind of really don't know how to share that space. So yeah. I appreciate that. When you standing like I that. do. All right, yeah. ladies, do we have any questions for him? Yes, uh, you asked, are we were local? Are you local? I'm not local, but I'm open to travel. I'm open to you from, flying Nick? out, flying you out. Um, just really making sure I make the connection because I'm serious. I'm serious. I'm really. Where are you located? I'm actually from New York City, but I currently reside in uh, Charlotte. Okay. Yeah. How old is your daughter? My daughter's nine, but she lives in she lives in Chicago with her mom. God damn, nigga. Yeah. You been flying pussy She's well taken with. care of. You from Any New questions York? on you your end? Charlotte? You flying the bitches um, out from... Your, your baby ain't got nothing. You said selfish. What do you mean by that? What do you mean? Yeah. Not being selfish. Meaning that you know how to share some of your love, your time, your attention, your space. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah. Um, I, I, I am selfish. Like, I'm a self... Like, not completely selfish. I, of course, I do have that all for my daughter, but I get told a lot from my exes like I do have like I do have selfish behavior and whatnot I was pretty spoiled growing up so I mean I just want to be honest so that way I ain't saying like, she a gold digger bamboozled so. <laughs> bamboozled okay. and you know that nigga he okay. loves but you have marks. room do you have room that to nigga share been with the Airbnb yeah, and put his pictures in there and fly yeah. a bitch yeah. out yeah. Yeah. but that yeah that, that, yeah, I, that is a part right of here. me yes so it's my yeah. okay we'll be back for her so why did we end up popping um I'm definitely so I I have children myself, okay. but my children are older, mm. um, well above nine. <laughs> so I am definitely in the stage of my life where I'm looking for someone who wants to be selfish with me. Um, I want all your time. I understand we work. I understand you have other responsibilities, but I need to be number one priority. And unfortunately, you got sisters, your daughter. You got a lot of people in front of me. 
Yeah, and that's just unfortunately not where I am in life. One, you just can't. My sisters are all in their own world. They, they they live in different countries. My sister live in Mexico. My other sister live in New York. They they all in their own world, married and just focused. So I'm out of their space. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, let me walk you on up. Ooh, ooh. Go ahead. Um, I just think that. She ain't finna get scammed. I don't by this think it's gonna be a batch. Like, so I'm gonna have to pop the balloon. Okay. <laughs> she like, I just think this nigga. Alright, so why'd you end up popping? I just don't see too much of like a not even necessarily connection because it's been two minutes. Mm -hmm. But yeah. you just remind me of someone. A I don't know, scam. someone in my family. <laughs> like okay. you too. Like my uncle or my dad. Like okay. I oh. think it's like you just remind me of something. So okay. Okay. Yeah. That's good. Right. Thank you. See, now you, now you know oh that man. Bitch. Well, that is the, the unfortunately all of the balloons popped. <gasps> but we do thank you so much for coming on. Let's go ahead and you give it up for our ladies. She just stepped up a little bit. Take the mic. So I never got a chance to uh, show the surprise. Oh. Okay. Do we get to see it still? <laughs> uh, see. I don't want to be nobody's last option. So. Mm. Boom. <laughs> Boom. So maybe next time. Okay. All right. Hey, she, Thank hey. you. Let's go ahead and give it up for him, lady. Applaud her for that. Um, uh, maybe she won the... Uh. Okay. Let's go ahead and bring out our that next single dumb. guy. Played himself. Oh, Hello. Welcome in. What the <laughs> fuck is this nigga? My name is Mo. Mo? <laughs> Mo. Like... Mo? Ah. Mo yeah, okay. And how old are you? This nigga impressive. I'm 38. 38. Okay. And what do you do? <laughs> I'm a creative impresario. Mm, okay. And what does that mean? So pretty much a uh, creative impresario is, a is a person that excels that in the arts. So I have a, a video production company called Dreamcast Video. Mm. And I'm also and got a, a, a brand. So head. I'm moan on a beat. Okay, cool. And now what are some things you look for in a woman? So I look for bitch. emotional stay with maturity. I look for... Uh, Consistency, what flag nation and pretty is that feet, on his... and good credit. Okay. But if you don't got good credit and you got bad credit, I know how to fix that to get us some funding. This nigga got an okay. infomercial. Okay, what got it. And now, what are some nigga? of your deal breakers? My deal breakers: ugly feet. So where's Waldo glasses? Um, deal breakers is also uh, attitude. I don't do attitude okay. and combativeness. I don't mm. do that either. Okay. You don't do All right, so we did get a couple of pop balloons. Let's go on over to some of these ladies and see why they ended up popping. This thing got his head, All man. right, if we can have your name and age. I'm Alexis, and I'm 29. Okay. Alexis, why did you pop your balloon? Um, I didn't really like the make you moan okay. statement, and um, you kind of look like coming to America right now. <laughs> I got you, man. I got you. But you know, hey, you know, as long as you're happy, I'm happy. For sure. I see you're used to dealing with peasants, so you don't know when you see a king. Okay. He had that one in the chamber. <laughs> he had that one in is the chamber. Is she someone that's your type? Uh, you know, I say I like feet. Oh. Okay. I ain't really feeling her feet. <laughs> oh, I'm kind of hot right now. So. <laughs> I told you, I told you, I told you. The feet ain't working for me, so. I told okay. you, I see, I see, this bitch got like six toes. Pretty, yeah. She definitely pretty, but you could look like Holly Berry. If you ain't got pretty feet, I ain't rocking with it. <laughs> Dress up. Let's go to okay. our next lady. Go ahead, sir. This we can have your name get, and age and why you ended up popping your like balloon. I'm Lexi and I'm 27. Look at the feet, dog. Um, get her. It's complicated. Uh, They're scared now. <laughs> you have no socks, so it is not. It's just not. You ain't no socks. Uh -huh. All right, you should have worn some socks. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> tell her. Tell her. Now is Lexi someone that's your type? Uh, let's look at and Lexi don't, real quick. Don't do too much. Oh, see, no, 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 don't be mad. No. I'm not gonna lie. Lexi, you kind of doing your thing, you know. Thanks. She got a she got a queen a queen look, okay. feet pretty, got a nice tattoo. Thank you. That tattoo um, look dope. That's your real hair. Hell no, yeah. nigga. Okay, well, I mean, if that's your real hair, yeah. Thank she you. She cool. Yeah, she look decent. Thank this bitch got whoop. This bitch like shit. Let's go on over here. Fight, you can have your name and age and why you, you ended up popping your balloon. My name is Tiffany and I'm 26 years old. It's just. You you seem like a funny guy. You just see, I love to laugh, but it's just giving real gimmicky. Sure. That's that's really it to me. Okay. It's just giving gimmicky. The moan statement. It's just giving gimmick to me. Cool. That's really it. Okay. Cool. I like that. <laughs> okay. So is Tiffany someone that's your type? Nah. Okay. And why not? Um, the fit is kind of cheesy to me. <coughs> kind of looking a little bit 
<laughs> rainbowish. You know what I'm saying? Um, no. I'm not. I'm not one that do lace fronts. Woo! So I don't really feel like the lace fronts. And um, but don't get it twisted. Damn. I can see through all that, and through all that, you beautiful. Thank you. You know what I'm saying? And you got a soul that glow. Thank you. you. But gimmicky, look me up. You see what's good okay. with me. Okay. Look me up. You see what's good with me. If we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. Oh, Hi, man. I'm C and I'm 36. Okay, C. I ended up popping my balloon because I didn't like some of the comments that you made, but also I don't like your outfit. I mean, I do think, um, I think it's great that you're 38. That's kind of the age range that I'm going for. Um, and you do seem funny, um, but I think, um, a lot of the guys before you kept it really like classy and really nice, and that's the type of guy that I'm looking for. I hear that. Someone nicer. Yeah. That's what's up. Okay. <laughs> is C someone that's your type? Uh, nah. C is pretty cool. Pre pretty feet. Thank you. Cool outfit. Well, right, I gotta outfit, zoom in on the I mean, feet now. People are saying I'm gimmicky. The outfit look kind of gimmicky. I thought I it was mean, a recent but, um, but a couple of years, my nigga, when you came out. What the better. fuck is and, that? And um, I like, I'm really like into like, I like, I really like natural. But again, just like, um, just like I mentioned with her, I'm all about uh, natural and I, I can see through it all and you're beautiful. You seem like you have like an aura that's, that's really you like glowing. LeBron James, mom. And I rock you like, I like um, Gloria beautiful James. skin. She's not that beautiful. Amazing skin. And yeah, she pretty cool. Okay. She, she cool. Thank she you. pretty. She Let's pretty go on cool. over here. If we can have your name and age I'll and why you ended up head. popping your balloon. Hi, my name is Nkiru and I'm 32. 32? Um, Tell a French story. I really don't know what to say, it's but uh, I don't think I feel like a connection between us. Mm. Um, I mean, you look nice, but I don't think you're the right person for me. Respect. Okay. And him, what's making you feel like he's not like really the right person for you? Bitch. Uh, but, but. Like some of the comments you made earlier, that was part of it. Um, and I don't know. I just, it just, I just don't feel the connection. Like traditional aspect. For sure. Traditionally, I don't. Where are you from? I'm Caribbean. I'm from originally from the USA. Yeah. Mother's Trinidadian, father's Jamaican. Oh, okay, yeah. Okay, nice. But sure. I don't think I feel the connection. My daughter Ooh. home. Yes. Got it. And now is she someone that's your type? She, She's giving me she real goddess away. energy. I can't wake up. Like the fit <laughs> is like um the fit is definitely on point. The rings, the gold, the glow, Everything the is. neck. The heels. Wait, he talking like Sammy Davis Jr. <laughs> no, I mean, I'm, I mean, I'll keep it 100. Yeah, yeah, I mean, baby. I know you said I yeah. s had comments back there, but, you know, I, I give credit when it's due. Oh, and you're okay. definitely going superstar. All right, thank you. Bless up yourself. You're you're your superstar. Hey. Who was that damn dude? Don Power Wash has three cleaning boosters not found in traditional dish soaps. It's more than soap. It's Power Wash. <laughs> All right, if we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. I'm Danielle and I'm 35. Mm -hmm. um, I popped my balloon originally because it just didn't match the kind of person that I am. Mm -hmm. um, personality wise, just coming out, just the way we're dressed, I feel like we wouldn't step out together. Okay. Um, but on top of that, I feel like you're going to tear me up and then break my ass right the fuck back down. Yeah, so see, they scared, I'll they stay scared clear now. of that. <laughs> For sure. All right, so is she someone that you type? Well, me uh, having Caribbean parents, I'm real big on energy and real big on auras. And you seem like you have an amazing aura. So I would, I would never it. break you down. Anybody that uh, rocks with me, I always lift them up. I'm an upgrader, I always upgrade. Anybody that I comes in my vicinity, my I my upgrade kid. them. You get what I'm saying? But you, beautiful feet, beautiful yeah. heels. The dress is immaculate. The watch is crazy. Okay. The tattoo is like that. The, face the kisses on the chest is like that. Hair is like that. I'm gonna give you this a salute. mine too. Don't. Oh, that's you? Yeah, this mine. That's this you? Mine. <laughs> so big up yourself, darling. Man, nah, worry yourself. I appreciate you. For sure. <laughs> All right, if we can have your name and age yeah. and why you ended up popping your balloon. My name's Kiana. I'm 32. Bless up yourself, Kiana. Yes, sir. <laughs> um, yeah, Kiana in 32. Uh, I popped my balloon because, it's mine you know, too. just um, touching seems shit very flat, not flashy, but showy and whatnot, okay. not understanding the fit. So I don't know if it's coming to America. like, But, I mean, as far as that's what it looks like, mm -hmm. and all power to you. But, yeah, just, sure. yeah. I just know if, I'm, if that's how you she dress, like, like, um, if we're going on a like date nebula. and whatnot. 
Guardians I'm of the Galaxy. Very, that's what this woman looked like. Kind of Pe- not this bitch at all face kind of blue. She look like Nebula. Yeah, that's it. From Guardians of the Galaxy. Yeah. With the little lines in it and shit. Now she's someone that you would approach. She's a minute to figure out who um, this bitch looks like. That's what she looked like. Which is Kiana? Nebula. Mm-hmm. Um, Kiana's cool. Um, she got real dark eyes. Miami. 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 Okay. So I'm from uh, Silver Spring, Maryland, but I know a lot of people in Southeast DC. You give me that type of vibe, which is um, which is smooth. Uh, your aura is beautiful. Um, you got, you kind of. I like the colors. Feet is gorgeous. I love feet. Feet this is gorgeous. Heels is, is different. I like that. But um, a lot of people not gonna understand where I'm at because I'm on like an elevated level. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> And again, like I told the other, anybody that come in my vicinity, I mm-hmm. upgrade them. You get you what I'm upgrade. saying? You upgrade, you what bitch. might seem gimmicky to some, is treasure to others. You know what I'm saying? So, treasure. Is she somebody that I would date? Some glasses um, too. Be like him. Not really. Uh, not really. Not because she isn't attractive, but I'm a I'm an artsy type of person. And when it comes to people that I, I can, weird with, hat. It's people I that weird um, hat. is in the artsy nature. You know what I mean? I do events, I do art shows, things like that. And I'm um, not saying that she doesn't fit that 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 vibe, but again, like the others, I can see through everything. And um, I got one question, like, and, and, it's, and it's really pertaining to you and a couple of other females with the lashes. What is it with women with lashes? What is it? Um, wait, I don't know. Like what you're what wearing you mean, a, a piece that's ex, 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 um, exemplifying your mm-hmm. everything about you so sure. that's what i'm doing i'm just wearing a piece that's exemplifying my beauty so no nah, you're be- trust me sweetheart you're beautiful yeah so i'm not i just um i think that a lot of times women when they're wearing the lashes i think they're wearing it for themselves and not knowing what a man really likes and a man really likes if you don't love yourself, how the hell you gonna love you somebody are. else? I'm the type of person where I'm gonna do head. everything how I want to do for myself, as far as like even yeah, what I'm eating, losing weight, because I'm just gonna do what how I want myself to look, for and sure. my man just has to like it. Right? For sure. Okay. So cool. she can wear the lashes. And I like that. Thank you. Sure. <laughs> Let's go back and play. <laughs> <this> okay. <way. laughs> All right. Well, unfortunately, that is all of the balloons pop. Get out of here, nigga. Do, thank you so much for coming on. Let's sure. give it up for him, ladies. Get out of here, Bless nigga. Bless up, y'all. Take this. Have a thank you. <laughs> I still don't know what nation it was. Oragel knows that oral pain keeps you from feeling like yourself. No nation, I don't know what that so was. reach. I thought it was all right, Haitian let's go ahead and bring out our like, next nah, single guy. Nah, Hello. Welcome in. Oh, Lord. What's your name? Oh, Lord. Uh, my name's June. June? Yep, June. Okay. Oh, Lord. Uh, 33. 33, and what do you do? Uh, I'm an actor, I'm a writer, producer, all oh, of that. Oh, Lord. Okay, all right. And uh, what are some things this you look for in a woman? Like... Um, someone who knows how to communicate. Uh, you think like Julius Randle. Who, um, I know we all go through things, but someone who's healed, preferably. Like uh, Omar Epps. And uh, someone Julius who's Randall. fun, you know, not too stuck up. Okay. Pretty much. <laughs> and uh, what are some of your deal breakers? Uh, somebody that smokes cigarettes. Yeah. Can't do cigarettes. Okay. Oh, damn. Are you cigarettes? That's why your tongue so damn small. You smoke right, cigarettes, so bitch. so we did get a couple of pop balloons. Uh, Let's go on right. over these ladies and see what's going on. That's a, that's a big <laughs> okay, bitch. Okay, you can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. Alexis, and I'm 29, and you said you don't like a smoker, and I'm an occasional smoker. You smoke cigarettes? Oh, sometimes, Ooh. yeah. <laughs> okay, okay. Hey, that's that's crazy. That's what's up. <laughs> no judgment, no judgment. Now, before he said that, you did have your balloon unpopped. Why so? Um, I mean, you know, he got a nice swag about him. So Appreciate it. Seemed like good personality. Okay, got it. And now, is uh, Alexis someone that's your type? Yeah, yeah, actually, yeah. Yeah, okay. she's she's very attractive. Thank you. <laughs> I, like the, I like the little diamonds in the teeth. I like I that. I think wearing his watch in his right hand is disgusting. <laughs> All right, let's go on to our next lady. All right, if we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. Well, my name is hand. Tiffany, and I'm 26, He's and I popped my balloon because you're giving me big couson vibes. Like, big you cousin. remind me of my big cousin, and it's just, mine, mine, yeah. yeah. But everything else, right. you seem like you're a ball of energy. You seem like somebody right. I could have fun with. But other than that, I Like, just specifically, you have a cousin specifically I remind you of? Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> Dang. Yeah. He must be cool as hell. That's what's yeah, up. he is. He's, uh, like, one of my favorites. <laughs> okay. All right. Okay. Now, is Tiffany someone that's your type? Yes, actually. Yeah, yeah. I like the fit. It's like... 
I like it. She matched it too. I like that. Got the little glitter. I like that. That's what's up. Thank you. All right. Let's go on to our I next know lady. Lead with a bitch. If we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. Hi, I'm C, and I'm 36. I popped your balloon See? because I felt friend friendship vibes, not not relationships. So y'all okay. um, like, can it. go together. That's fair. Yeah. That's fair. That's fair. All right. <laughs> that's fair. So, is C someone that you approach? Is she someone that's your type? Uh, yes, actually, I like I like the dress. You Thank know what you. I'm saying? She she looked like she fit too. I like that. Thanks. That's she looked like he's got our next bitch. lady over They're here. Like we can thing. have your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. My Maybe it's profile is disgusting. Every time I see it, but I know. Oh, uh, the reason why I popped is, uh, I think you look a little too young for me. Young. Yeah. I'm older than you. <laughs> yes, yes, but I like them a little, a little older than that. Yeah. Okay, you like them to look older, not actually. Be no, older. no, like older, like probably like from thirty-five. Oh, okay, yeah. got you. And uh, other than that, you look good, but um, I just feel like yeah, too young, too young for me. Okay. Yes. <laughs> older than you is too young. That's what's up. <laughs> that's that's crazy. That's what's up. Okay. Okay, and now is she someone that you type? Uh. Yeah, yeah, I like the hair. I like the hair. I like, like the makeup. I like the the eyelashes. I do. I do. I like the. I like the dress. I don't like the shoes too much, but I like the dress. I like the dress. Shoes, sure. them shoes, disgusting. <laughs> right, you. you look nice though. You look beautiful. Them shoes thank is you. disgusting. Okay. All right, so we do still have you look, three unpopped balloons. Shoes, like so I'm gonna go ahead and have you ask these ladies a question just to kind of help you narrow it down, see who's more of your match. Okay. Um. What are you guys most passionate about? Guys. Okay. We'll start with your name and age, and what are you most passionate about? Uh, my name is Lexi. I'm 27. Um, there are probably two things that I'm really, really passionate about. One is Still serving my community. I'm a birth doula, and I mm. make plant-based skincare. Doula, so I'm do. really passionate about helping my community. And, and then the and other thing is traveling. Like, nasty, I love to travel man. the world. I love solo traveling. That's just kind of my thing. I want to see what's beyond me and where I live. So those are the things I'm passionate what's, about. What's your favorite place to go? Where's my favorite place to go? Hmm. hmm. I've been in Mexico six times, so probably Mexico. What you okay. doing over in Mexico? I like okay. the food, the people. I, tequila. Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> how, how, did you, how old did you say you were? It's 27. 27. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Good little ponytail. Yeah, that's All good. Right. Let's, Bring let's go to our next lady down here. Ah, come on. <laughs> Shut up, bitch. We'll start with your name and age, and what are some things you're passionate about? Yes. Or what are you passionate about? Yep. I'm Danielle, and I'm 35. Um, the things that I'm most passionate about is my future, honestly. Uh, I'm very ambitious. Um, I'm always looking for what's to do next. Um, and then that's pretty much it. <laughs> that's where I am in life. Of, of what to do next. Okay. Yeah, what's next? Nah, that's fair. That's fair. <laughs> you said you're how old? I'm 35. 35. Okay. Can I, can I ask her another question? Do you have kids? I do. How many? I have three. How many uh, fathers? I was once married. So just one? Yes. How long were you married? Eight years. Oh. Okay. <laughs> nah, that's what's up. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I, that's, I like that. Okay. All right. Your name and age, and what are you passionate about? Like lying. My name is Kiana. I'm yeah, 32. And I'll say I'm passionate about just setting a foundation for my daughter and whatnot. And yeah, just that. How old's your daughter? 12. 12? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. how, you said you were how old? 32. 32. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. That and music. Just like I heard was daughter. He you hear sing? Passion. I have I have a voice, <laughs> so yeah. Is that a yes? Y yeah, it's <laughs> not a no. Okay, okay, <laughs> okay. Everybody like bitch you can't okay, sing. People know her like. So based saying. off of those responses you've seen, you've heard, and what you've seen so far, I'm like gonna go and have you pop one of these ladies' balloons. So let me hand you a toothpick. Go for the white. She look like the the realest out of them. Just one. Yep, just one for this round. Keep her. Keep okay. one in the white. Keep the one in the Why white. you just assume it was you? <laughs> <laughs> why you just assume she just stuck hers out like oh self sacrifice? That's crazy. <laughs> All right, so why did you end up popping hers? Um, you just like I know you said you like music, but if you were a singer, like you just didn't seem like you had the confidence, you know what I mean? Like, I was like, Do you sing? You was like, eh. Eh. 
I do. Oh. Yeah, so I was like, man, if you was a singer, you supposed to be like, yeah, I sing. Episode, yeah. I, I'm, episodes, not, I'm not Whitney Houston, Beyonce. Right. I'm like a you very, yeah. Nah, that's, so. that's cool. That's cool. I just, bitches, I just like I, women that are confident. You know what I mean? Probably one of the best group of bitches you look, they had you, on You beautiful show. though. That's a, that's All right, so we do have bitches. our two ladies left. I'm gonna go back and look. Ladies, do we have any questions for him? I had like the best bodies up here on this one. Okay, we'll start here, then we'll go to you. Oh, wait. Hmm. Ain't one nothing. Ain't one What is your relationship crazy, like with like, your parents? Oh man. They okay. Had no um, on this episode. I would say the uh, trap uh, my relationship with my mom is, is a, pretty good. She absolutely like, knows. You know, uh, I that. think we're getting to a point now where we're pushing towards the healthy side. Um, it took some time, but I think we're getting there. And your dad? Uh, he wasn't in my life. Like she cute so, when you take all you know, her makeup off, boy. And her not lashes. relevant. I don't know, man. She got a, she got like okay. real good cheekbones and, and shit. That's like probably the best one for that's you, it for bro. Now. Okay. okay. <laughs> and she had one down here. Let's head on over here. All Boy, right. What was your question? Do you have children? No. Do you want children? Yes. I'm done. I have three. Oh, yeah, because you got three. I'm done, yes. Hey, I understand. Like, I, I understand. <laughs> dang. She's like, dang. But you I didn't really miss like, out. I like, miss uh, out of I like everything see? about him. And don't take this the wrong the way. Like, it's shit. just my definition of it. But I like Lane. <laughs> I'm like. That's crazy. No, that's you weird you give off. Like, I truly, I love it. That's my, that's my type of man. Like, I feel like we could definitely have a ton of fun. That's but baby, I can't give my more kids. <laughs> I'm That's trying crazy. to save myself okay. some type of hey, We did get one more back here. Like Why did we end With up popping? Squares. Okay, so squares. like, like yeah. somebody I'm said, not. you do kind of give like best friend, brother, big bro vibes, and right. then also like I want a really big family. Like oh I'm really big on family. Like whoever I'm with, I want them to have a really great relationship with both their mom and dad, just because like family is really important. She just made me Facts, mad yeah. right now. Facts. Yeah. <gasps> she said, my like lames. That bitch back there said, my wife will always say that shit about me. Like, she like lames, she like squares. I'm looking like, bitch, I'm a thug, man. What you talking about? <sighs> all hey. right, well, that's all the balloons right, popped, unfortunately. Her. But we do thank you for coming on. Let's go ahead and give well, it up for him, ladies. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, get, fuck you all bitch. right, let's go you ahead and bring out our next lame. single guy. All right, we'll see this next nigga. Hello, welcome in. I'll have you hold that. Oh, What's your Lord. name? All right, my name is Kess. Kess? Yeah. Okay, how old are you? I'm 29 years old. 29, and this what do you do? I uh, work in finance uh, as a day job, and um, I uh, also coach AU house? basketball. That's how I give back to the community. Okay, and now what are you some things to look for in a woman? I just might as caring. Uh, somebody yeah. that's, um, you know, you understanding. You somebody to bring home the moms. Okay. And, uh, it's just that's about it. Got it. Head okay. Head. And now, what are some of your deal breakers? Smoking. Mm. I can't do smoking. No smoking. <laughs> okay. No, so we did get a couple of hot balloons. Boy. Let's go on over to these ladies and see, you know, this what's going on. <laughs> if we can have your name and age and like, why you ended up popping. Um, Alexis, and I'm 29. Mm -hmm. Okay. And why'd you pop? Um, I smoke from time to time, so. <laughs> Oh, that I get out the way for you. <laughs> Go Hawks. All right. And now, um, you know, she does say she's a smoker. Apart from that, is she someone that is your type, though? Ah, yeah, she's fine. She's popping this meathead, hey. motherfucker. I like that. Yeah, 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 like the nice baby. Too. Appreciate you. Thank you. All right, let's go over to our next ladies over here. If we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. My name is Tiffany. I'm 26, and I smoke a little weed, you <laughs> hey. know, so. But you are very handsome. Yeah, that very handsome. <laughs> All right, and now is Tiffany I'm someone that's your type? Handsome. Yeah, she's valid too. Okay. Yeah, she's nice. All right. she's nice. Now, before he said that, you did have your balloon unpopped. Yeah, Why I was so? Like hesitating because I was like, does he mean cigarettes or weed? Because, you know, some guys just don't like cigarettes and some guys just don't like weed. So I didn't know if it's both or just one, okay. you know? Yeah, fortunately, it's both. It's okay. both. Okay. <laughs> I understand. All right, let's go over to our next lady over here. Yep. If we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. Hi, I'm C and I'm 36. Smoke, I popped smoke. my balloon because, um, just the height, okay. but, oh. the, but everything else, I mean, you're in finance. I like your outfit. Don't tell me so, how good, good I am. You didn't tell me no, bitch. <laughs> All right, now I see someone that way. you would approach to your type. Yeah, she is actually. Yeah, she seems like a good vibe. Uh, I would, I would good approach vibe her personality. school so, yeah. starts. Okay. I need All a damn trapper Let's go on over here. If we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. 
Hi, my name is Nkiru, and I'm 32. Uh, the reason why I popped is, oh, same thing with her, do like the height. Yeah. Yeah, right. I like them a little taller, but besides that, you look great. I wish I was great. a little bit taller. I wish I, I was am. a ball, though. Mm -hmm. I wish I had a good Now, uh, is she someone that is your type? Uh, I would say, yeah, but I feel like, you know, I, I think sometimes um, it, it seems as though you're not welcoming. Uh, it seemed like uh, your facial expressions were like, don't talk to me. So, <laughs> you know, I, I like somebody who I can go and talk to, <laughs> not be afraid to talk she to. Mean. So, she looked like this, Nail yeah, Carter. Okay. Have you gotten that before? Chief, <laughs> Chief. Yeah. Like, give me a break. Give me that show. I didn't know it was short my face. <laughs> but yeah, sometimes okay, okay. I do have like that straight face. Like, be quiet, Chief. <laughs> Thank you. Jeez. And let's go down over here. If we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. Kiana, I'm 32. Um, very handsome, clean, love the teeth. Are those veneer? Well, don't even matter. Like, they look nice. <laughs> really clean. Um, I just, you know, I'm not a smoker. Wow, man. That thing but inside I do her know, like, a lot of um, smokers. I would not even know like, a lot of um, smokers, but she, she I just do know... People that those that like suffer from PTSD, it kind of calms 19. them. So I'm just like, you know, That's maybe not. So, yeah. okay. And now, is she someone that is your type? She is. She is. Hey, what makes her your type? Oh. Um, right. <laughs> starting to do some shit. Gravity. Stop. Oh. <laughs> She's nice. Uh, I think, uh, again, the way she speaks, uh, the what I get from her, she got a long uh, the physical. Long. Yeah. Thank you. Body episode, okay, man. so we do have two balloons left and, and popped. I'm going to go ahead and 13. have you ask these ladies a question just to kind of help you narrow it down, see who's more your type. Okay, yeah. Um, so from your prior relationship, what's one thing you learned about yourself that you're working on? Big boxer head, mm. nigga. You, gotta, mm, mm, you know what? We always start with you. Let's start down there. <laughs> And then we'll come back. <laughs> All right, we'll start with your name and age Big and the answer to his question. Uh, my name is Danielle and I'm 35. And something that I learned about me from my prior relationship is um, that I was working on is communication. Um, I've always well, thought that I had top tier communication because I, so, I, I, I talk a lot. Nose, um, but maybe take a step <laughs> back, listen a little bit better. And yeah, that's was the feedback for me. Nice. All right. Oh, come on, We're man. about to see if these two antiperspirants can stand up to the heat. That's it. Yes, come on. Let's go. Okay, let's start with your name and age and the answer to his question. I'm Lexi and I'm 27. And something that I learned from prior relationships is probably... Dang, I lost it. Um, dang, I lost it. Cause you okay. mean shit. Uh, but you, um, you don't mean I don't know. You Another mean. thing is just patience. Just like you know, yeah, being patient with people. Function. Oh, that's what it was. Understanding. Both like a lot of times, like I feel like I do things in a certain order, and I do things in a way that I would want someone else to do it. So understanding that everyone is different, and everybody's not me, and everybody kind of does things on in their own way. Okay. Yeah. All right. Now, ladies, any questions for him? I'll ask the same question. Okay, go for it. What is your relationship like with your parents? With my parents? Yes. So um, my mom and my, my sister and my nephews did a world to me. Um, that's really, that's my why. That's my reason for why I wake up and do what I do. Um, outside of that, my dad and I, we don't have the best connection. Um, I think that's a problem with a lot of black families. Uh, so I'm trying to rewrite that script. So, yeah. Okay. Good. Yeah. Okay. Let's head down over here. All right, any questions for him? Yes. So you seem well, pop con balloon, conservative, <laughs> reserved very much. What is something that you do to kind of let loose, show more of your personality? So it is nerve wracking <laughs> so, as part of it. Uh, but outside of that, like I said, um, I, I coach AU basketball. So that's where a lot of my screaming and yelling and going all into it, uh, the kids it goes into the like kids. The kids um, outside of that, I'm really an easy going guy. So yeah. And you want kids? I love kids. <laughs> I just don't want any more. She's trying to find her out. That's all. She's right. trying to find her out. Let's go on That's back. That's a good out. Though. I want to see the rest of that, that um, fat tattoo. Like okay, yes. Another question. Do you have I don't kids? like her tattoo on no the front. Kids. 
That shit look, I don't know what, what it is. Mm. What is your idea of a great first date? Oh, God. Great first date. So, um, I think it would be selfish of me if I only stated what I would want to do. Fuck so, that would be something we would communicate. Okay. Uh, but for me, what I, you know, what I tend to uh, thrive in is finding some right, sort of mom and pop restaurant to support. Mm -hmm. and we can have a conversation. Day, that's the best thing. Okay, I have a couple more questions. <laughs> Like, Are you confident, like, say? with your height? Because I'm tall. <laughs> of course, yeah. You are? Yeah, my so, exes are tall. So. Oh, I don't care about your ex. <laughs> I got to say. I don't care about your ex, bitch. What else? I think that's it that's for it? now. Yeah. Okay. All right. Good. Let me bring she you on crazy. up she here. Come good. on up. Come on she up. Crazy. All right. So she said this she ain't got no more questions. One? Any final end? And any final questions on your end? Yeah, I just got two. Okay. That's okay. Okay. So when was the last time you been it's you were dead. genuinely happy? Oh. I'm happy right now. I'm happy every single day. Like I'm living the life that I want to live. Like I said earlier, like I travel. I'm a full time student. I'm pursuing my passion. I'm a pre med student. I'm a birth time. doula. I own a skincare business. Like these are nice. things that, I, that make me happy, too. that fulfill me. So nice. I have family. I have friends that love me. I'm happy. I'm saying, the longer you look at these bitches, okay. like, on first impression, I'm ready to roast them. Uh, after a while, they start looking better. In heels, yeah. Yeah, but in general, no. Cool. So you're not missing out. That's good. I was about to ask another question, but I can't remember. I got to bubble here, boy. Yeah. Take her home. Oh, that's hopefully on that date. So I got... Out of them. <laughs> okay, okay. Where do you live? So originally, I'm from Brooklyn, New York, but I live in Charlotte right now. Okay. Yeah. I live in Atlanta. Does that Vegas. work? Yeah, yeah it works. It works better than fucking Brooklyn and... Okay, okay. So oh, my final question, is it a yes for you for him? Yeah. And is it a yes for you for her? Of course. Yeah. We got a match! <laughs> I'll take this and you guys can go on up. Oh. Sign up to be a member if you want free shipping. Hey. All right, yeah, let's go ahead and bring out our next that, single guy. Ah. Hey, commercials, man. Hey, the girl rapper. Hello, welcome ah. in. I'll have oh, you Lord. hold that. What's your name? My name is Michael. Michael, how old are you? 28. 28, and what do you do? Uh, I'm a sales cha -cha. manager. Okay, all right. And now, what are some things you look for in a woman? Uh, I look for a woman that's got confidence, um, can do her own thing. Um, that's that's pretty much it. Okay. Now, what are some of your deal breakers? Deal breakers. Oh, man. He likes skin, so he want a dark skin. Deal breakers. Mm. That's together. a tough one. I mean, I'm not too picky, to be honest. Um, as long as you have a good personality, you have a good foundation. Um, really, I, I, I don't really have anything. It just really mm. comes down to each person individually okay. uh, as far as what I'm they're looking, like, looking what their roster. upbringing is. Mm. So All that's right. really it. I'm cool. not too picky. I'm looking at, I'm looking at your <laughs> what are some things like to do for fun? Uh, for fun, I love to uh, spend really time with my do. family. I like to play basketball, go to the gym, Hernandez. Um, What's work on. Joshua had business that I've started, so face bitch look like pretty well-rounded, I would think. Okay, like so we did get a pop balloon. Just going over there, there and see what's going on. All right, if we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. Hi, my name is Nkiru, and I'm 32. 32. Um, I just feel like you're a little too light for me. I like my man a little dark skin, and um, and I'm not too big on tattoos. Okay. I see you have like a little bit of tattoos. I'm not really too big on that, but other than that, you look great, but just not my type. Hey, that's okay. I thank you. Um, tattoos are just a uh, tribute to my father, so something I like to show off. Um, father, so but I appreciate that. There's nothing wrong with that. Okay. And now, is she someone that's your type? Um, I don't really have a type. I think you are very beautiful. You have very beautiful eyes. I love thank your you hair, your thank dress, you. everything about you looks good. So, I, I, yeah. Okay. <laughs> thank you. All right, so we have quite a few balloons left. I'm going to go ahead and have you ask the place a question just to kind of help you narrow it down. Yeah. Oh, man. Um, <laughs> do I start in any particular order? Oh, it's going to be a general question for all of oh, them. Oh, general question. Yeah. Um, well, I guess off the rip, um, where are you at right now in life as far as what you're looking for in a partner, in a relationship? Oh, my God. Okay. All right. We'll start with your name and age and the answer to this question. I'm Alexis and I'm 29 and um, I think I'm kind of just looking for like a partner in crime, someone that can be my best friend and someone that I can build with. 
name and age and the answer to this question. My name is Tiffany. I'm 26, and I'm basically looking for somebody I could have fun with, somebody who can guide me, but also learn from me as well, someone I could build with. Your name and age and the answer to this question. Hi, I'm C, and I'm 36. Um, I'm looking for a long-term monogamous relationship, potentially marriage. (laughs) (laughs) Name and age and the answer to this question. I'm Danielle and I'm 35 Joshua and Hernandez, I'm looking TBB. for someone to have fun with, a little spontaneous partner to just explore and Zeus try new now. things. Your name and age and the answer to this question. Uh, my name's Kiana, I'm 32. I'm currently looking for a, a shit, serious relationship, like the back someone who I can build longevity <laughs> with and whatnot. And yeah. I know that little piece of paper right. I put in the back of a fish tank. And All just, right. And so I am going to have like you me. pop two balloons, you know, based off of what you're seeing, what you've heard, all that good stuff. So let me give you a pick. Yeah, one got a damn yeah. Have you hold that. Okay. Go ahead and pop. Can I ask a question? No. After this round. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Get Jocelyn Hernandez face up out of here. <laughs> Look at him. Okay, Soft and then just one more. Pop. I know one popped, oh. but you gotta pop one more. Look at him. <laughs> uh, this nigga zesty as fuck. This nigga finna be on um fame. He finna start doing some goddamn ballerina shit. I'll have you stay there. Like so we'll start with the first one. Yes, pop. And so why did you end up popping her? <laughs> I don't really have a reason. So Dancing far, everybody's stars. been really great and open and honest, which I appreciate. Uh, sounds like you are at a point in your life that you're ready for something serious. I don't know if our age gap would be an issue. Um, that was probably the only thing that I was maybe a little hesitant about. But How old are you? 28. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. I mean, I didn't. I didn't hear that. Sorry. Like, yeah. yeah, that is pretty. I mean, I do like dating older guys, but yeah. Okay. okay. Let's go over here. So, why did we end up popping her balloon? I don't know. I just had to, and <laughs> like, I don't want to. I think again, it was the same thing, kind of the age gap. I don't know if you prefer somebody older. I'm a little bit younger. However, come I have experienced a lot of life for a 28 year old, but I know that is a thing for some people, and I didn't know if it was for you. Man. So I, just, I had to do it. I'm sorry. Somebody, baby, That's like, fine. His <laughs> loss. You like white girls. <laughs> and so you did have your balloon unpop for him. Why so? Girl. I thought he was very handsome. Um, the age typically don't bother me too much. Um, I mean, he probably gonna want some kids, but you know, it's like whatever. <laughs> I'm not gonna have his kids, but uh, he ain't looking for nothing uh, serious though. So, fun times. Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and we did get a popped balloon over here. Why did we end up popping our balloon? Yeah. So I love your tattoos. Um, Thank you. I love that you're in sales. I'm in sales also. Hey, okay. um, but it is the age gap. Y'all see that little totally thing understand. The top. Totally like, understand. I don't see Have you dated somebody arm. older than you before? No. Um, well, by six months. So I don't know <laughs> if that really counts. But so yes, technically on technicality. <laughs> I don't think that really counts. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> okay. And have you dated someone younger than you before? I have, and I, my preference is like, like my too, age or older. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. Yeah. Cool. Okay. Well, let's back it up. So we still do have two unpopped balloons. Okay. So I know you had another question brewing in your head. I'm going to go ahead and have you ask these ladies. Oh, man. Uh, <laughs> have either of you ever dated anybody with kids? Is that a deal breaker for you? Um. Yes, I've dated someone with kids. I have two kids of my own, so not a deal breaker. You got kids? Okay. Yes, I've dated someone with kids, no, and I have a kid. He's two. Everybody else. Okay. All right. You have, an, you have kids, I'm guessing, because you asked that? I do. I have a five-year-old and a two-year-old son, okay. so I do okay. have kids. So. White girl, and yeah. they stated they both have children. That's a deal breaker for you or no? No, absolutely not. All right. Okay. So, ladies, I'm going to go ahead and have you guys ask him a question if you have yes. any. In Florida, marijuana is already available on the streets, and you have no idea what's in it. Amendment three fixes that. It mandates. See, I ain't like that. I think she's she's. You hear that commercial, man? Now they're telling you not to buy street weed. Now, you see, remember it was illegal. Everybody, weed was so illegal. Now this, hey man, you don't want to buy that shit off the street? Come buy from us, the government. 
We can put our own chemicals in it and shit. That's how I get mine from <laughs> the government, so I don't know. It's already ready. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Let's go over here. Is both your kids by the same woman? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Yes, ma'am. What color was she? The only question? Oh, do you mind dating someone that is an exotic dancer? No, that's okay. your thing. You gotta, you gotta <laughs> play feed him. your child. You know what I mean. <laughs> some people, some men are insecure and they can't handle me I'm, I'm working in a club where nah. other men are showing me attention. Yeah, nah. That ain't me. Okay. Yeah, nah. <laughs> Any questions over here? Um, where do you live? I live here. I'm a local. I live here in Queen Creek, so not too far away. There's a little bit of a hike to get here, but I'm here and I'm glad I am. <laughs> okay. Okay. We good, ladies? All right, so I am gonna have you pop one of their balloons. Can I ask one more question? Go for it, go for it. So you, you fist pump, so you live here? Yes, okay. I live here. You live here? Yeah. Where do you live? Um, I live like Southern Arizona, so it's a few hours away from here. Are we talking Tucson? It's more Southern than there. So Sierra Vista? Like yeah, how you know about Sierra Vista? Because <laughs> I went to Fort Huachuca back in the day. Okay. So I know, I know where that is. Okay. Kay. Yep, that's where I'm at. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> All right, you got your question in. Who we popping? <laughs> Go with the cockeyed stripper. Oh dang. Okay. Oh. Why do you end up popping hers? Cause she a cockeyed stripper. <laughs> that's why. I don't know. <laughs> There's no reason, to be honest. I just, you're very beautiful. You're Thank good looking. You. you have a great smile. You have the Sammy um, Davis eye. I just had no choice. I had to. There, there, there was no reason, honestly. It's okay. Okay. All right. Let's bring you on up. Bring you on up. Okay. Any final questions between the two of you? Oh. I don't have any. Okay. Okay. All right. So, is it gonna be a yes for you for him? Yes. And is it a yes for you for her? Absolutely. We got a match! <laughs> I'll take this mic and you guys can go on up. Yeah, let's give it up. There it is, right there. I didn't think it was going to end that way. I don't know. It just, um, it was lackluster. It's all right, episode. It probably has some of the, um, best looking bitches in this episode. I don't mean to call them bitches, but hey, you know who I am, man. You know how I get down. You know how I talk. It's me, Ice Man the Folk. I go live on the channel every Friday at 9 p.m. talking about something every Friday at 9 p.m. But in the meantime, we do stuff like this, man. And right now, I'm really enjoying this Pop the Balloon or Find Love, the series, man. I like um, basically just judging people. I mean, hey. I do it every day. You can do it too, man. Judge people. Because <laughs> only God can judge me. Nah, y'all know what I mean, though. Anyway, I go live with the channel every Friday at 9 p.m. Hit that like button, the comment button, the share button, the subscribe button, notification bell, all them good buttons you got to hit to get this pippin' that I'm putting out when I put it out. Like I said, I go live on Fridays, man. This has been Pop the Balloon of Fine Love, episode 13. See you next time. Fuck with your boy, Ice Man the Fool. This is a dangerous group that groups that we're dealing with now. All right. This time, but I'll be back. And sooner than you think. Wherever there's prejudice, ignorance, inequality, I'll be there.